Over the years, Graft Diamonds has showcased absolutely breathtaking pieces, including the $46 million Graft Pink Diamond, which held the record for most expensive pink diamond in the world for multiple years in a row. This famous pink diamond was not the only record holder from Graf, however. On the first day of Basel World 2014, Graf unveiled their timepiece collection, and one watch stood out among the rest, the Graf Diamond's hallucination. How much is the Graf Diamond's hallucination watch worth? But before we start, please like the video and subscribe to the channel for more luxury content. Priced at $55 million, the Graf Diamond hallucination currently holds the record for most expensive watch ever made. The term watch, though, can be used very loosely here. Amidst the myriad of breathtaking, beautiful diamonds, a small quartz dial surrounded by small pink diamonds can be seen right in the center of the piece. Why is the Graf Diamond's hallucination watch so expensive? The value of this timepiece does not come from the quartz dial embedded in the center, but by what is surrounding it. More specifically, the Graf hallucination is comprised by a multitude of fancy vivid yellow, fancy intense blue, Fancy light gray blue, fancy green, fancy orange, and of course, fancy intense pink, and fancy light pink diamonds. Although the diamonds on this watch weigh a staggering 110 carats, to add to its beauty, a large variety of cuts have been used, including marquise, radiant, pear, round, and heart-shaped diamonds. Despite the quartz dial not being the piece de resistance, it is by no means just for show. The tiny dial is incredibly precise when it comes to telling time and doesn't require frequent winding or power reserve. It is a long-lasting, accurate, and beautiful piece of equipment, turning the entire watch not only into a remarkable accessory, but a practical one for a very lucky lady. How did the idea of the Graf Hallucination watch come to be? The idea behind making this record-setting timepiece came from Lawrence Graf, the chairman of Graf Diamonds. After all, no one else on the lower rungs of the company ladder could even conceive of a $55 million timepiece without a raised eyebrow or two. He stated that, For many years I've thought about creating a truly remarkable watch that illustrates our all-consuming passion for diamonds. The hallucination has made my dream a reality. He continued, The graph hallucination is a sculptural masterpiece, a celebration of the miracle of colored diamonds. Mr. Graf was born and bred in London. He started out as an apprentice to a jeweler in the Hatton Garden District. Being a mere apprentice did not last long. Very soon he was creating his own jewelry pieces. By the time he was 24, he had already opened two of his own jewelry stores in London. As he traveled the globe, his clientele grew and so did the demand for more important jewelry pieces. Astoundingly, by the age of 30, he had set up one of the biggest jewelry manufacturing businesses in Britain. In 1973, he became the first jeweler to receive the Queen's Award to Industry and Export. He opened up his flagship store on Bond Street. Today, the company has 45 stores around the globe with corporate offices in London, New York, Geneva, Hong Kong, and Tokyo. Mr. Graf was toying with the idea of creating the Graf Diamonds hallucination timepiece for quite some time. In Mr. Graf's words, for many years, I've thought about creating a truly remarkable watch that illustrates our all-consuming passion for diamonds. The hallucination has made my dream a reality. Why did Graf Diamonds make the Grand Hallucination Watch? Graf wanted to showcase the company's authority, excellence, innovation, and skill in the diamond industry, from manufacturing to retail. And the Graf Hallucination was an excellent piece to display their superiority. While the team of top diamond cutters and specialists in a key to Graf's success, there is another factor that helps the company excel at what they do. Lawrence Graf is the controlling shareholder in the South African Diamond Corporation, which is one of the biggest diamond producers in South Africa, sporting the largest polishing and cutting factories based out of Johannesburg. Among the thousands of diamonds, Mr. Graf always looked for the rarest diamond, either in the raw or cut and polished. In his quest for the ultimate diamond, some of the most treasured gemstones passed through his fingers, the latest of which is the famous 550 CT Letseng Star, which was found, as with many other rare Graf diamonds, in the Letseng mine in Lesotho. The hunt for diamonds goes on. We searched on a daily basis for stones, in the rough or polished. The best stones are rarer than anyone could ever imagine, Lawrence Graf said. The Graf Diamonds hallucination, which holds many of these rare finds in a single timepiece. Top-notch designers, gemologists, and master craftsmen spent literally thousands of hours creating this piece of horological jewelry. 
Mr. Graft realized he went a tad over the top with the outrageous value of the Graft Diamond's hallucination, especially to the layperson who may scrutinize every aspect of the timepiece. He cushioned the blow with the title of the timepiece, The Hallucination. Comment below what you think about the Graf Hallucination watch. Are there any other famous watches you would like us to cover? Let us know in the comments below and subscribe to the channel to get all the video updates.